Hi there, this is Paige with Stamp Girl here on YouTube and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm sharing with you the card and product I made for the Case of Card collab um, here on YouTube. We are, the group, small group of us are casing cards from current Stampin' Up! catalogs. And in this case, um, the word case is copy and selectively edit. So you can case something exactly the way it is or change things however you want to, but you choose a card from a current catalog to inspire you to make your own card. So I used this mini catalog from Stampin' Up! January to June 2021 and on page 44 I found a card that inspired me and that is this one right here. I loved the color combination, I loved the arrangement of the flowers and the strawberries and I like this little subtle stamping in the background. So I cased mine very much like this one. I did not use the sentiment on the front and I did not have the little ladybug trinkets. But here is my card. So I used obviously the Sweet Strawberry set from Stampin' Up! and I used this image. Um, these two, I think the smaller ones maybe, and then the strawberry in the shadow, and then the stem in the shadow. And then to get this layer right here, I used these ornate layers dies, and I believe it was, sorry for the glare, this one right here. So I have a granny apple green card base, and then I used um, that die cut layer also from Granny Apple Green. And then this white panel, what I did is I stamped the um, little branches, little twigs and flowers and leaves with Granny Apple Green and then took a blending brush and just lightly shaded on some color. And then I stamped and punched out with this um, coordinating punch. It punches out the stem, the leaf, the flower, and the strawberry. So I punched those out and I layered the leaves, the stems on top, and then these are all popped up with dimensionals, just clustered in the middle. And then some flowers I glued down flat and others I popped up. And then I went over the highlight area of the strawberries and all the petals of the flowers with Winka Stella. Then I had a little puffy ladybug sticker that I added there. And then I had some brown twine that I just curly cued under the images. So um, a close match to what's in the catalog. Then I wanted to case something else, and this wasn't from the catalog, but it was from my friend Deb. Deb Houck's Crafty Cottage. She had on one of her lives used this stamp set and she made a little pizza box and it was so adorable. And I asked her if it was okay if I cased her project and she said it was. And so I did that. So I covered the bottom with some garden green cardstock. This paper is in the Celebration catalog. It's free. It comes with another stamp set. It's free with a $100 purchase. So I just used some of that pattern paper and matted it with garden green all the way around and then a piece on the front. And then um, this stamp that was so sweet of you. I stamped that and used the double oval punch from Stampin' Up! And here I stamped the strawberries on Poppy Parade cardstock. I stamped and punched out three of them. I folded two of them in half and kept one flat and then glued the halves onto um, the other strawberries so it was three-dimensional. 
And then I added a little ladybug sticker that seems to be coming off right on the leaf. And then for the inside, I had some little strawberry candies that I thought were so cute to go with this um, paper, strawberry paper. So there is my case um, from a project by Deb Hauk. So here's my card and my project. I'd like to thank you so much for joining me. Down below will be a link to all the participants in this collaboration, so please see what card from the Stampin' Up! catalogs inspired them to create. And now I'm off to create.